What's up? It's Dr. Katie from thedollarchallengeclub.com and if I know one thing, it's that you are a busy lady. You're busy. You are in the car, you are going from here to there, you are going everywhere. And you can't always sit down and eat your healthy meals at the table. You can't prepare everything. You need something that's gonna be grab and go, but still healthy and isn't gonna derail you from your healthy eating habits. So I wanna share with you three three things that I always have in my cabinet, which will we'll saunter on over there right now. Uh, things I always have in my cabinet and actually a lot of the time have like in my diaper bag or in my purse, um, just for those times where I'm you know, out and I don't wanna go get something crappy through the drive-thru, I want something healthy that will satiate me get rid of that hunger pang, beat my snack attack um, while still being delicious and healthy. Nutrient dense, not calorie dense. So I'm gonna flip around here to my cabinet. This is the snack cabinet, the most important cabinet of all the cabinets. And you'll see, this is the like kids section. Does anybody else's kids like these damn puffs more than life itself? Cause this is like all Rowan. <laughs> wants to eat is these puffs. Um, but this is my snack cabinet and things that I always have in here. Number one, Lara bars. Uh, RX bars are another really, really delicious and uh, clean brand. Um, the trick with these, so these are the kind of thing that, you know, if you look at the ingredients, this is not the best example, um, but if you look at the ingredients for most flavors of Lara bar, you know what, let me turn off this flash here. That's kind of blinding. Most flavors of Lara bar they're pretty simple ingredients. My favorite ones are, there's a peanut butter cookie, there's a cashew cookie, there's like blueberry, apple. Those are all really simple in terms of their, their ingredients. There's usually only like two or three. It'll be, you know, whatever the fruit is, dates and nuts. Those are the best Lara bars. The ones I have in my cabinet, not the best. There is added sugar um, in the peanut butter chocolate chip. Um, not in the peanut butter cookie though, but these are Andrew's like favorite snack ever. Um, but the thing about these is, you know, they are very clean in terms of their ingredients. However, you know, dates are, they're high in sugar. They're also high in fiber, which means that even though you're eating, you know, a decent amount of sugar, which has, you know, a high amount of carbs, you're also getting fiber. So it's, uh, absorbed by the body. Um, your blood sugar isn't going to go up quite as uh, quickly as if you were eating a more simple sugar. Um, so it's absorbed in the body a little bit more slowly. So it does give you energy um, without giving you that big sugar crash, like if you're eating a cookie per se. Um, so these are a great grab and go kind of thing. I, I like these a lot for like a pre-workout just to get that energy. Um, but the caution I have with these is that even though they might have clean ingredients, that doesn't mean that you can eat 10 of these a day. Because again, it's naturally occurring sugar, but it's still sugar. Um, so it's still calories, it's still going to be not so good for you if you're eating a ton of these. Um, they're again, great thing to just kind of have in your back pocket, in your purse, if you need something to fill you up, Lara bars. Um, but again, get the ones that don't have chocolate. <laughs> look at your ingredients, look for the ones that don't have any added sugar. Um, let me flip around again here. Um, I'm almost out, ah, I need to buy more, I need to order more. These are my favorite beef sticks on the freaking planet. I cannot like it over it enough. And actually this is my favorite flavor. This one or the summer sausage. Uh, it's kind of a tie between, between the two, but these Paleo Valley uh, grass fed beef. These, I have, if you ever take the time to look at the ingredients on a beef stick, it's disgusting <laughs> what's in most of them. This one is fantastic. Actually, this is the only one I think that has any added sugar, just in the form of raw honey. Um, but the ingredients in here, it's literally just the beef, in this case the honey, and then like spices. Um, and it's got a collagen casing. And this actually had probiotics, which I love. Anything that is good for the gut is like my favorite thing ever. Um, and these taste really, really good. So I'm gonna put the link for these. I totally forgot to do that. Um, so I'll put the link for these because um, I've only been able to find them online um, and I actually have a coupon code. Um, so I will put the link for these for you to try because they're freaking wonderful. There's literally always one in my purse or in my diaper bag. You can ask my friends because I'll give them to my friends sometimes when we're out. It's like, hey, you want to be sick? It's a good, a good conversation starter. 
Um, and then the last thing I have, uh. I actually get these at Aldi. Aldi has been my freaking jam lately. Um, but these quinoa meals. So again, let me flip around. But this is just another thing. This you actually can eat without heating it up. It, I, whenever I eat it at home, I do actually put it in the microwave and heat it up because I think it tastes better. Um, but like it says on there, ready to eat quinoa meal. And there's a bunch of different flavors. Um, but again, I always look at the ingredients because you can be tricked and something can look really healthy and you turn around and there's added sugar, added you know, artificial flavoring, added junk, junk, junk. Um, but this is actually um, pretty good in terms of what's in it. You know, really just the quinoa and seasonings. So it's kind of awesome. Uh, the brand on this, I know there's a few companies that make this. It's called Earthly Grains. And again, I got it at Aldi. These were like $1.99. It's amazing. Um, so these are the three things that I always have in my cabinet, and they're great to carry around with you when you're ever in a bind, you're stuck in traffic, you're on the go, and you don't want to eat something unhealthy. You've got something at your disposal to keep you on track keep you satiated and continue on with this healthy lifestyle that you are kicking ass at. So that is all I have. I'm going to put that link for those uh, beef sticks if anybody wants to try them because I think they're the best of any other single one I've uh, ever found. Put everything away. And if you have any questions about any of these, um, drop me a comment, drop me a message, um, whatever, and I would love to talk to you. If you have any snack, um, snack additions to add. I would love to hear those as well. I'm always up for learning something new. And please send me some good vibes that this cold, I, I get over it soon because I know I'm sounding kind of uh, nasty to you. So that is it. Have a great one, guys. Thanks for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.